guys and welcome back to Man of Medan. Um, in this episode, Whoa. I think we're yeah. going to be More diving. Oh, ah, that's a shock. She been flissing so tight. She acts like we're going to ransack the plane. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> not like we can scan the wreck every night uh, and find Wait, who were we playing yeah. as? That shape. I think it said we're. That's gotta be it. Did Whoa. it say who we were playing as that or didn't it? Like <laughs> way bigger than I thought. Damn. Because I th think we were going it's to switch. Too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. Don't you use the F word on my Christian? <laughs> no. Ah, oh, that joke is so overused. Howdy, Captain. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You? Oh. Are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh and eager cabin boy. Still a no. Your well paying, <laughs> dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Dashingly handsome. Mm, no. Pass. I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? You know it's not polite to ask a lady about her money. Fair enough. I was just thinking about buying a boat myself and I thought maybe you'd like to point me in the right direction. It would be my singular pleasure to help you part with your money. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Okay, maybe aye, I was aye. a bit too bitchy. <laughs> I just try and choose what I think the characters would choose. Weather looks clear. Mm-hmm. Mm. I'll have to keep an eye on those clouds. Okay. Uh-oh. It's getting mighty crowded out here. Oof, mighty crowded this. Another boat. Oh no. Let's see. Don't think I'm going to see anything on the camera. Wait, what's what's that? No, no, no. No, not that. This. Duke to Alex. Duke to Julia? Okay, so they're not really answering me. Those assholes. Um. <laughs> Can I actually see anything over there? I don't think so. No. was kind of that direction, I think. But I can't see anything. Hmm. To be fair, it's pretty uh, misty in that direction. Cloudy and misty. No, nope. don't talk to him yet. Actually, no, I want to go to <laughs> No. Oh, that's my license. Oh yeah, yeah, it's a fishy one. Let's go down. So we saw that painting. Is there anything I can do here? Oh, don't do that. What's this? See, her name is spelled wrong. Felicité Dubois. This letter is a formal notification that you are on default of your obligation to make regular payments on your personal loan. The loan holds a remainder of 24,783 with a sum of 3,481 payable by 
1st of August 2019, this amount has been overdue since that date, um, and you appear to have ignored multiple requests for payments or a discussion to reconsolidate your debt. Unless the outstanding amount is received by 30th of August, we will have no choice but to begin the foreclosure process against your collateral, namely the marine vessel, the Duke of Milan. Hmm. Dive trip is 5,000, hotel tours, Eddie's fishing trips, sell laptop, total for the month. Call the bank and cancel yourself. Hmm. She's having some money issues. Oh, maybe I can go in the lock thing now. Yes, there's a painting here. Why oh. do I keep these around? A good question. I'd be freaked out if I looked at paintings and they would suddenly give me a look into the future. Uh, let's look to Brad. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. I think she would hey, be nice to him. It's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I think she'd like I him the most. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. Um. I hope they know what they're doing down there. Attitude matters 20 meters down. Alex plays the goof, but he was pretty serious about acing his diving certification. Hmm. What other dives have they done? When I got the booking, I thought they were newbies. Alex and Julia have both logged plenty of dives. I'm the real amateur, but I'm ready. Huh. Gotta get back up top. Check. Check you later. Don't hey, know why the game cut that off. Look, there's a boat. Hey, is that the boat they, uh, that was in the premonition? What's that about? That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? This feels... off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid. Okay. It's Conrad. He's going to say something stupid, isn't he? He's going to say something stupid. Guys, you gotta keep back. We've got divers in the water. Oh, I can actually... Sorry for interrupting the scene, but I'm worried I can't look at this otherwise. She's deceitful, frank, altruistic and guarded. Fliss and Julia don't have anything. Fliss acknowledged that Alex has some diving experience. Alex apologized, okay. Brad didn't like Fliss's comments, but she was sympathetic. Oh. I misclicked, so I'll look at their relationship later. Hey, we got damage here, you see this? Look at our boat! We can you did that on purpose. Man. It's not a problem. What do you think? Like, uh, ten bucks cover it? Conrad. Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it twenty. Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like thirty? I can do thirty. Alright, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. That's not a good move. Because I think they did that intentionally for the money. And now they're like, oh. It's loaded. Hmm. Don't have a good feeling about that. Especially because of the premonition. I think it was that guy. Ah. Anyway, on to the diving. Spooky. Ooh, that's a bullet hole. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Really. On the rear turret. Huh. Good on ya, Connie. <laughs> so we're playing as Julia now. The turret. We can get in through there. Ooh. 
Yeah, you can get an infection if you cut yourself. Uh, ladies first. <laughs> okay, so this is the flashlight. Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not wait. Oh god, she's having a heart attack. Oh, that one is called Devil in the Deep. So how did I get that one unlocked on my game? I don't get it. Julia, leave it. I don't remember to playing this part. Get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Nah. Don't be such a gonad. I'll be fine. <laughs> a gonad. gonad? Seriously? <laughs> Am I dead? What's happening? Live okay. a little edgelord. <laughs> okay. want to get that in my face. Jesus, I'd be out of breath by now. Ooh, perfect. <laughs> See, we're fine. You do something stupid down here, that's it. One chance, you get that. Chill out, I'm fine, see? No problemo. <laughs> no problemo. Mm, searching areas. Mm. It says it was a rescue plane. Launched from a US base. Mm. They were on their way to help out a ship. Kind of trying to see if I'm not missing stuff. Nice. Oh, it's a Bullet secret. Holes. All down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. <laughs> oh. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's hmm. see what else we can find. I'm worried that this is timed, which is why I'm going so fast. Good God. <sighs> nah, let's not do that. Actually, yes, let's do that. Ugh. 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 He's holding something. Wow. What the hell happened here? Good question. Well, look at things. They knew they were goners. You hear that? Let's check it out. Oh no. You can only use that once, can't you? Ooh. He's holding a gun. My wetsuit. My life is really? lemons. Ew. <laughs> the game was telling me like, pilot, oh, you need to move. Co-pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. True. 
Then again, there's probably also worse things. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should not be doing that. Oh, there's nothing else I can do. Okay. that because they hit the dive line. <gasps> shark? Now there's a shark? Yeah, come at me, shark! <laughs> it's a come at me! Shark. Not interested in us. Let's go. <laughs> Let me see. Julia is cunning, courageous, selfish, and generous. That doesn't really add up, does it? Julia tried to reassure Alex. Julia ignored Alex. Huh. It's not going so well. Okay, she doesn't oh really have anything. Uh, oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. But I guess no time's the right time. I, I, I don't I guess. Oh. Oh. I know you can't tell because we're underwater, but. I'm on my knees right now. Uh-huh. Julia, uh -huh. will you marry me? You're shitting me, right? What? <laughs> like there's a hidden camera down here or something? Uh... Okay, come on, guys! The gig is up! Julia, Can't you just say yes? I'm serious. I think she loves him. Alex, wow. What a goddamn story. How's it end? Yes! Yes! I'll marry the shit out of you! <laughs> I'll marry the shit out of you. That's a fake threat. Alright, handsome hero. You wanna Aww. get on with our escape from the, uh, crumbling death trap? Aw, it's kinda cute. Fliss, this is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Aww. So yeah, that's a fisher hey, boat. That it's kind of just a speedboat. Wait, Julia, we gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. Yeah, we have to. Damn it. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. Otherwise she's... Oh, I think that's what the um, the scene is about. If you don't Fuck decompress, it, you can die of an embolism or uh, is it? It's an embolism, right? Yeah, you can get an embolism to your hey, heart. Hey, what the hell is going on? Uh, hey JJ, don't worry about it. There was a little, uh, mishap with the barbecue. Oh. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. Hmm. What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? <laughs> what I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys! Can you all just shut up for, like, one second? Holy shit! Dude, <laughs> bro, congrats! Nicely done! Come up and let's celebrate! Oh. But, uh, yeah, I think I want to end the episode here, because I've been going for so long, so after the curator finishes talking, um, I'm going to be ending the episode. So what does he have to say? <laughs> Oh, don't laugh at me. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. 
Oh. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. I think I did an he, okay job. <laughs> what about Conrad? A bold fellow, He's you stupid. might say. Or maybe you'd say arrogant. Very arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss. Strong, forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms. So far, at least. Well. Let me reassure you. You help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. And some they'll regret. And some I think they may regret. Well. <laughs> but yeah, I'll be finishing here. So, see you next time. Bye!